Hi, I'm Georgia Flu, and I only drink things that are caffeinated or alcoholic, so I'm very excited for right now. And I'm Magenta with a J, and I can't wait to espresso myself with this particular drink. Espresso yourself. Madonna reference. Yes. And, and we're, we're Face Down Queens. Queens. And, and welcome, welcome to Drinks on the House. House Down Boots, Mama Gaga. Yes. One thing that I am actually well known for are my delicious espresso martinis. And believe it or not, my friends and I had a blind taste test of five or six different espresso martinis that I won. Wow. Yeah, this is quality right here, people. I'm a big fan of espresso martinis. They're one of my favorite mm. drinks to get when I'm out. So I'm going to be a very harsh judge. Oh, okay. Much like many beverages, you start with some ice and a shaker. Um, and pro tip, make sure your ice is cold. I personally think it's important to use real espresso. If you don't have that, you can use regular coffee. Just keep in mind you'll need more of it to get that coffee flavor. So you'll probably water down the drink a bit because espresso is so concentrated. Strong. Yes. All right, so putting in my shot here. So the ingredients that I like to use are Kahlua, Kahlua. espresso flavored vodka, and regular vodka. Oh. If you really want it sweet instead of regular vodka, you could use vanilla vodka as well. But I basically do one to one to one ratio of the alcohols. And actually, it's pretty much about the same as an espresso shot, so. So one to one to one to one. Yes, one, 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 one. So we got a Kahlua, huh? Huh? putting it in there. Kahlua. Also, uh, a lot of people like to make these creamy, adding Baileys. Mm. I don't really like the creamy stuff because it gets a little, I don't know. Diarrhea-y. Yeah. <laughs> Alcohol and dairy can be a hard time, especially if you're a lactose intolerant bottom mm -hmm. like some of us. All right, so I'm putting in the espresso flavored vodka and I will tell you, it can be hard to find. I will say that three olives is the best. Three olives. Yeah, No that's more, my no less. Yeah. And then um, some vodka, just regular old vodka. Vodka, fan favorite. Our good friend. Work fan favorite. All right, so I put everything in a shaker. What happens hey, now? Oh, oh yeah. Time. Make sure it's held tight. I do own my own cocktail shaker also. I stole it from a TGI Fridays. Oh. Shaken. That's a good way to get things. Stealing. <laughs> From only from large corporations, don't steal from small local businesses. That is a good point. Now we're pouring, we're pouring. We're pouring, flying. I kind of go back and forth to make sure they're roughly even. And then I would recommend those last little bits, shake them out and get some good foam. Foam. Oh. Good foam, good ass foam. Ass foam. The kind you could carve some hips out of. Now. Drag queen humor. Yeah. That's, that's, we're actually partially made out of couch cushions. So one thing that I always like to add at the end, because I feel like it's a critical garnish, mm -hmm. is precisely three coffee beans. Look, sort of like three olives, mm. but it's coffee beans. The key is three. There's three alcohols in there, three beans, three olives. Are we ready for this? It's full. Oh my goodness. Cheers. Ah. Oh yeah, that's, that's the good stuff. That is good. Well done. We're just gonna ASMR the next 20 minutes while drinking Mason. <sighs> I've watched like no <laughs> ASMR, so I don't, it makes me very anxious, so I don't actually know what I would do. This isn't ASMR, but I, so when I was doing music videos as a boy, I had a video where I was, you could see my bare feet in it quite a bit. And I was getting a surprising number of views for it. And I was like, what's oh, no. going on? And I looked at the source. It was a foot fetish I website. I knew you were gonna say that. <laughs> I'm like, well, the views of you. <laughs> so Georgia, what did you Drum think? roll, please. I give it a nine. Oh, yes. It's very tasty. And I'm, as I said, a very harsh judge of espresso martinis. I liked how you provided like variations on mm -hmm, this, mm -hmm. but it's you went with a classic version of it. Use this as a starting point, experiment. Let us know what you think. Mm -hmm. Georgia, we forgot to tell people what should they do now that they've watched this amazing instructional entertaining they video. Know. They should like the video because mm -hmm. we know they liked the video. So mm -hmm. like express that, espresso that. You should also comment on this video. Tell us your variations on the classic oh, espresso yeah. martini. 
How do you think this could be improved? Do you think it could be improved? How do you think we could be improved? Be mean. We know you will. We know you have it in you. Subscribe to this channel for more content. Classic Reflu will continue to be going on. And share this video with all of your friends. Absolutely. Let them know we're not just the Reflu anymore. I don't remember how we ended the other one. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.